The short demo will explain how to transfer data from a standard DVD to either a USB or SD for playback in any of our media players. Uh, so you can do this on a Mac or a PC. Simply uh, load your DVD into your computer and then uh, also load your SD in. And I'll just take a couple seconds to get recognized. So here on my computer, my SD is the no name. And sometimes what'll happen is your DVD will just start playing depending on what kind of uh, applications you have. So here I'm just gonna cancel this and I wanna escape out of here. I don't wanna play the movie, I wanna copy it. So. so basically here in my SD card, I don't have any files. This is something that's automatically put on um, any Android devices, so you don't have to worry about that. And then here's the DVD. Uh, inside DVD, we're looking for a video TS folder. All uh, standard DVDs have this. So you double click on there, and you'll see a variety of files. And what we're looking for is the VOB files. So you can sort them by kind, or you can just kind of dig through there, and you see here are these VOB files. These are all the video files for the DVD. And you can see the sizes over here. So this little one here, 47K, it's very small. So we're not sure what that is. We probably don't need it, but what you can do is just double click on it and it'll open a program on your computer. Uh, my computer here, it's uh, it's VLC and nothing's coming up. So probably means there's, there's nothing really on there. So we can take a look at these other ones just to verify you know, which files you want. We can see this is one of those files here. It's called the 01. Here's underscore two, and then here's underscore three. So this way you can kind of preview the files that are on there. And then really all we're gonna do is we're gonna just copy them. So we're just gonna grab these three files. You can do them one at a time or all three at once. And we're gonna drag them over to this no name right here. And now it's gonna begin copying. Uh, these are pretty large files. This is about two and a half gigabytes going from a DVD to USB. It's a little slow. It's gonna take about 20 minutes. Uh, but once they're done, they're going to be copied over to this SD card here. And once everything's copied, all I'm going to do is eject it by clicking right here. And then I'll load it in the player. And it's going to play in order. So it's going to play this one first, the two second, and the three third. Uh, keep in mind, this only works for uncopyrighted DVDs. So these are discs that you've authored yourself or you've had a company author for you that has given you the authorization to transfer the data. Uh, this will not work for mainstream movies, you know, such as Disney movies or any mainstream movie. They're copy protected. Uh, you don't have the rights to do it, and it will not allow uh, the files to be played. But that's pretty much it. All you need to do is transfer it over. Once it's copied, eject it, load it in the player, and you're done. <laughs>